Wow. Um, I'm just jumping on here because I had an amazing day. Like, today has been one of the best days. The last two weeks probably have been one hell of a ride. I was planning on moving in with one of my staff. And, um, if we did it the right way, it would have worked out. But we did it the wrong way, and so it didn't work out. Um, there was a lot of unknowns for me. A lot of the choices that was made for me, I don't understand. But God is amazing. It's amazing. He is one of the best blessings I've had. And I've only been going to church for about a month. But it's so worth it. The people that I know, the people I've met, the people that have my back, are willing to help me out, it is great. I have no regrets. Nothing. But then, just um, a couple weeks ago, um, not a couple weeks ago, probably, yeah, it might be 22 weeks ago, um, I found out a friend of mine was murdered. And that was hard. And then, the hockey boys. And I have to say, I am so sorry to the boys in the family and the hockey team that lost 16 people. You are in my prayers, you are in my thoughts, and there's going to be a lot of people praying and hoping you guys can find peace. I watched... um, Late last night, about one of the per- one of the guys from the hockey team, the Bronco boys, who was in that horrific car- uh, hockey- uh, bus crash. Um, he's actually one. He's one of the. I believe there's two boys paralyzed, and on YouTube, um, I watched. Um, uh, sorry, I watched. I heard this CBC, this lady talking to Ryan, that's what one of the boys' name, who's paralyzed. He has nothing bad. He is so positive that I hope to God he still has to this day, for the rest of his life, because he... He want from what I heard yesterday, last or whenever, um, he 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 wanted to help. He woke up, um, when the bus crashed. He woke up. He could not move. He wanted to go help the boys, help his teammates, and I that had to be crying because he couldn't move. There was the lady that saved a lot of the boys, and. He actually met her. He met Justin Trudeau, who everybody could say what they want about him. But the people that need the support are the families that lost who they lost. The teammates, even the bus driver, who, it is so sad But I'm glad that the bus driver, whether it comes his fault or not his fault, I hope to God each and every one can find peace. Because I've been told everything happens for a reason. And I never believed that. I never did. Until I found Jesus. And I have to believe, in a way, this had to happen. Whether... I don't want to say that, but it did. It, you can't, you can't change what happened. But the outcome, the support, the the every everything that everybody's doing 
is what matters. These boys, these families, their friends, their families, they're hurting. I went to, um, uh, whatever it's called for two of the boys that live in, they were by, Stone, they're from Stony Plain. One of them moved from Slave Lake to Stony Plain. I live in Spruce Grove, and it was 2,000 people showed up at the hockey rink in Spruce Grove for the boys. It was hard. I went to my last funeral. Um, that song from Lou Bryan, Drink a Beer, that was the song that they played at the my aunt's boyfriend's funeral. And I cried. And I couldn't listen to that song for probably about a year after. And then they played it on Tuesday, Wednesday, Wednesday, or t Wednesday night. And then I, I didn't want to cry because I didn't really know, no, there was a lot of people that didn't really know, know him, but I didn't know him at all. I never actually watched them play. So it was really hard. And then they played Luke Bryan's Drink of Beer. And I just bawled, I bawled, but... The support, the, all I want to do is give him a hug and show my love because this team, the hockey community is hurting. You can't take that away. This bus crash made a lot of people hurt. And whether there's nothing we can do, all we can do is be there for him. So if any boys, any of the guys see this, I just want to say I'm very sorry. And I want to do anything I can, whether I cannot give you money because I'm low on money. I just want to be there for you guys. So, I want them to know. I want you guys to know. Ryan, um, I am very sorry for everybody that lost somebody in that car, that bus crash. Um, I don't know what else to say. I just wanted to jump on, but God is good. He... Everybody has to find their own way. But understand. There's so many people behind you. I send my love. I send condo condolences to your family and your friends, girlfriends, boyfriends. Well, yeah. Your, your siblings. I'm... I hope this goes for the hockey team. I wish, I hope that you guys see this because this would mean a lot for me to let you guys see this. So I am, that's all I have to say. I love you guys. I'm here for you guys. And I hope you guys make it. I hope you guys can heal from this. Alright, thanks guys. Bye.